Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel and in this short video I'll be showing you how to override those mode on your Google Pixel with all these apps installed on your phone. Now this question has been asked quite a few times on my social media and also on YouTube that Jay often our phone goes into deep sleep mode or doze mode and we don't get to see our notifications and they come across only when they pick the phone up or when they activate the phone. So I'll show you how to override those mode for individual apps on your phone so that your notification don't get blocked. So let's tap into settings first of all and from here let's go into the battery settings. Uh, there we go. And then on the top right corner tap here guys and go into battery optimization. Now here you can see all those apps which are not optimized are listed here. Now if you tap here you'll see all apps options. Uh, this shows goes to show you all the apps that I installed on my phone and also not optimized. That means they are the ones which will uh, override those and your notifications will still come across. I've got WhatsApp there as not optimized already. So let's go into all apps here and then let's pick a couple of more apps up and let me show you how this is done. So first of all let's pick up uh, let's say Google Plus if you can find it. Uh, there we go. So Google Plus here, once you tap on Google Plus, it shows you recommended for better battery life. Obviously, when you optimize it, that means that Doze is optimizing all the notifications and the app. So any notification that come across will be blocked once the phone is in Doze mode. But if you tap on don't optimize, what that means is that those will get overridden and the notification will come across. Obviously, that will drain your battery, like I say, it may drain your battery more quickly because obviously the app will be running at the back end. So once you tap on done, there we go and let's pick another one up say Instagram for instance and also tap on don't optimize and then press done. Now once you go up there and tap on not optimize then all these apps which are not optimized will come up in this list. So you can see here Google Plus, Instagram and WhatsApp are the apps which are not optimized. That means those will not work on them even if the phone goes into deep sleep mode the notifications for these apps will come across once your message is sent by the user on the other end like on Instagram or WhatsApp or Google Plus. But mind you by you keeping these apps up and not optimizing means that phone might not go into those mode as well. So please keep that in mind. However, in my general experience, keeping a few apps on not optimized doesn't drain the battery as much because the Pixel has got a very good battery life and so far it hasn't been a problem for me to be honest. So guys, this was a quick tip showing you how to override uh, notifications for your individual apps on the Google Pixel. And by the way, this uh, holds true for any phone running Android Marshmallow or Android Noga 7.0 or 7.1. Every time you go into any phone settings, you go into battery settings, you will see the same option on the top right corner or somewhere here left or right, obviously depending on which kind of UI you are interacting with. But for vanilla Android, this is what the option is like and you can have this on any phone running Marshmallow or Android Noga 7.0 or 7.1. So guys, if you got any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comment section. And if you please uh, like my video, uh, do give it a thumbs up. I appreciate that. And please subscribe to my channel as it helps. And I shall see you in the next video.